Last year, we went on a mission trip to Guatemala with my family. I don't really talk about it too much, but uh, we grew up, you know, pretty poor. Uh, my family, we were you know, refugees. We came over here with, with nothing but the clothes on our backs. And my parents didn't let that get to us, and we got through that. I've been there before, and um, being in a place like that, it kind of um, hit home again, and um, I want to make a difference. Joy is a feeling that you get when you when you do something that you know you're supposed to, and then it's everlasting. Like you, you feel that that joy in your heart, and it lasts a long time. Whereas happiness is more short term. We've talked about this in our household because. A trip to the beach, you're happy while you're at the beach, but when you come back, you know, that happiness, um, it's, it's, it's over, you know, and so you kind of get back to the way life is. But when we went on this mission trip, we came back, it left joy in our heart. My company, we do a um, tour of charities, and uh, I came across one um, near, real close to where I live called The Extension. They help men coming off addiction and homelessness, and so they, they help them with rehab and getting them back into the community. I serve food with them uh, once a month. They're just very appreciative that you're there because, um, you know, they're going through a lot and just someone pouring out, you know, for them, that helps them as well. When I serve food at the homeless shelter, I mean, that's joy that you will feel um, that, that lasts for you for a long time. And it makes you get this feeling that you just want to do more. I challenge those who have never um, volunteered or, you know, haven't gone out on their own and volunteered. I think that if you are scared or are uncomfortable doing it, look, look, look close to the house, you know, close to your house first in your community. There's so many opportunities here locally. There's your church um, here at Burt Hickory. There's all kinds of opportunities here. The children's ministry, Radiate, you know, men's, women's ministry. There's so many ministries that are always looking for volunteer. They can't do what they do without us. Schools are always looking for volunteers, uh, and we all just think somebody else would do it. But, you know, you're vested in it. It's your community, it's your children's school. And um, yeah, someone else can do it, but if you do it, it'll bring you joy and you will want to do more and, and look at other opportunities where then you can branch out and, you know, maybe look at a homeless shelter or, you know, a children's home. Um, and, and then from there, you could look at a, a mission trip. If you've never been on a mission trip, I highly recommend one because it, it'll change your life forever.